Hello there and welcome. Have you ever noticed in a lot of the new cars now, they have vibrators in the seat, massagers? It feels good, then. You know why? Alters the vibration range. See, this thing you're living in, this thing we call a body, this is a mass of molecules in a very high speed of vibration. There's about 11 million kilowatt hours per pound potential energy locked up in the electrons in the atoms of your body. This thing is a mass of living energy. It vibrates, in fact, it glows. That's right. Your brain is an electronic switching station. And you know the thoughts you think dictate the vibration you're in. When you think negative thoughts, I don't care what it's about, you can be picking out and figure out what's wrong with someone, what's wrong with the weather, what's wrong with the town or other people. You are putting yourself in a bad vibration. And when you get in a bad vibration, you know what you're gonna attract? You're gonna attract equal an amount of like energy. That's right. See, it's the vibration we're in that dictates what we do. It's the vibration we're in that dictates how we feel. Feeling is a word we invented to describe our conscious awareness of the vibration we're in. And it's our thoughts that control our vibration. We say thoughts are things. I'm gonna tell you something. Thoughts are moving right into form with and through you. Make certain that you're choosing upbeat thoughts and you'll be in a good vibration. Have you ever notice how you listen to really sweet music, you move into a very good vibration? That's right. The chaotic stuff, it scrambles your brains. Think about it. The law of vibration. We teach a lot about that. It's something you really want to understand because the good you want is already here and it's on a level of vibration, we call it frequency. Click the link, leave your information, and study this. Check us out at proctorgallagherinstitute.com for tips, tools, and resources.